Hello everyone. Uh, today I'm going to discuss the solution for question one from the recently concluded KOMF one paper one three in seven zero nine paper one three May June twenty twenty five. Uh, I have received requests for discussing the solution to question one. So uh, let's just go through uh, the question. This question is very simple. A curve has equation y equals 2x plus 12 over x squared. Find the equation of the tangent to the curve at the point negative 2, negative 1. Give your answer in the form y equals mx plus c. This is a four mark question. Something like this can be done in less than four minutes if you know what you're doing. All right. Now, look at the main goal here is to find the equation of the tangent to the curve. And the thing that you have to uh, be very familiar with is that the tangent to the curve is describing a line. So basically you want to find the equation of a line. And equation of a line, um, in order to make any equation of a line, you only need two things, right? If you have these two things, you have these two information, you will be able to write down the equation of the tangent to a, a curve or any straight line. Really. The equation of any straight line will require only two things, and that is gradient and one point on the line so every time you're asked about finding the equation of a line make sure that you have these two information the gradient of the line and the coordinates of one point on the line so let's do our check right now right do we have these information now out of these two right do we have the gradient no we don't have the gradient yet right the equation of the tangent to the curve we don't know the gradient of this tangent to the curve but what we do know is one point on this line, that is the point negative 2, negative 1. So one of these is known. So this gives us focus, right? We already know now what we need to do, and that is we need to go ahead and find the gradient of this line, right? So now the thing about tangent to a curve is that at the point of tangency, the gradient of the tangent to the curve and the gradient of the curve itself will be equal. Okay. The gradient of the curve and the gradient of the tangent to the curve at the point of tangency will be equal. And so that means if we can find the gradient of the curve at this point, we will also have found the gradient of the tangent to the curve at this point. So uh, we already have the equation of the curve. So in order to find the gradient of that curve, we will have to find its gradient function. And that can be found by differentiating the curve, right? Differentiating uh, the curve, finding dy dx will enable us to find the gradient function of this curve. So um, right now, it's not in a form that is very easy to differentiate. So we will change uh, the form, right? We'll write it in index form. So in index form, y equals 2x plus 12x power negative 2. This is much easier to differentiate. We'll just use the power rule. So just differentiate normally dy dx, you'll get 2 minus 24x power negative 3. Okay, I think uh, you all know how to uh, differentiate this, right? To, to get this form. And then after that, we'll substitute the value x equals negative 2 to find that gradient. So the gradient of the line that we want, right? Just substitute negative 2 in there, do it carefully, and you'll get 5. Very convenient for you, right? Very nice number there, 5. And so now, we will have both information. Gradient is known. One point on the line is known. So, they ask us to write in y equals mx plus c. So, we'll do that. We'll substitute the information that we already have, which is the gradient, right, represented by m there. So, we have y equals 5x plus c. One more thing we need to find. We need to find this value of c here. We'll substitute the x and y from the point of tangency into x and y in the equation so we'll go ahead and do that and from there we can get the value of c and that c is 9 okay so we'll get 9 for c now don't stop there some students right again they like to stop when they have a letter equals a number and they think they're done right we usually go back to the question see what they want the question wants you to write down the equation of the tangent in this form so we will go ahead and do that we'll substitute 9 into c and we will get y equals 5x plus 9 and this is the equation of 
the tangent to the curve at point negative 2, negative 1. So if you do get this answer, if you do get y equals 5x plus 9 as your answer, then you have done a good job.